Vicky needs to stay in the OC if you met a nice, if she met a nice guy in New York, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's right. one anywhere. Do you- I offer to drive the van when we, when we go cross, cross country. I want to drive the van for that show. Well, obviously you have to be in the show too, Rick. I mean, come on. Like <laughs> some network needs to green light this, right? <laughs> What about, so <laughs> do you think you would ever be in any universe, go there with Heather? Like, is there any way that maybe one day the two of you, Heather and Terry could be like, can you say three nice things about Heather right now? <laughs> um, three nice things about Heather. She's a good mom, a good wife and a good sister. Those are three things. Yeah. And her lawyer writes good letters. And her lawyer writes good letters. <laughs> so I've heard. <laughs> Do you, you know, to your point, like you were so free, you guys said whatever you want, you know, like, and that is, I mean, the thing is like, to your point, what you were trying to say before, like it's a reality show. So whether people agree with you or not, you are authentically yourself living your best life, saying what is your truth. I don't understand why everyone has such a problem with you either. Because isn't that what we want? Whether, like, I'm just like you guys. I might not agree with anything you're saying. I don't care. I disagree with you, period. We don't need to have a conversation about it. I don't agree with any, not, not you guys, just in general in life. Right, no, I get when it. When I disagree with someone, it's like, I don't agree with you. And I don't, that doesn't mean we can't be friends, right? Right. Well, that's how it's supposed to work. So yeah. we can all that's, how we, that's how it's supposed to work. Exchange of ideas, exchange of viewpoints and opinions is supposed to be how we all grow. We learn from each other. We grow from each other. And we don't have to agree. No, it, you, it, you learn more when you don't. You, you learn more about someone else's position. And you know what? The, the more I know, the more I don't know. So, you know, if somebody wants to present something at me and I, I might not know or I might, might grow at something, then, you know. Do you got, do you regret like looking back? And I'm not saying you should like, just like, man, like I should have like played in the sandbox with Bronwyn, like, you know, just played nicer, you know, so to speak. Like if you say you get like got fired because of the politics. Should I have been more like Gina and, and Shannon and Emily where you just shut up and you don't have an opinion and, you know, no, because I'm, I'm, I'm happy because I got, I get to speak my truth. I don't get to, I'm not full of shit. Not that they are, but they, you know, I know how, I know how a lot of them believe and say, and you know what? I mean, maybe they were smarter than I was and they didn't, you know, you know, they didn't like half of the country hate them, you know, but you know what? I stay true to myself and I'm, I'm, I'm happy and I'm glad that, you know, I took a stand and I, you know, I, I don't regret anything at all. I regret uh, doing a scene without my shirt on in bed with Kelly. I just wish I had put a shirt on. Well, that's when we self-filmed. Yeah. I don't even remember that scene. So I'm yeah, now I'm yeah. going to have to go back and it watch. It doesn't matter though that the last season we only, it was with the production, we only filmed for two weeks and like, then it shut down. I was like, oh, that was the worst um, ever. Well, yeah, because we, we self-filmed on our own iPhone. Of course, it was going to be a bad. COVID just hit, you know. Yeah, yeah. Things were getting shut down. We was, had to shut down production. Like, it was remarkable we, that they put a show together. I was, was just remarkable. entertainment I, does not miss a beat, right? You know this. Like they don't miss a beat. It's like, how are you going to do a show? And here we are. We have a show, right? Mm -hmm. No, I, I, I would agree with that. Do you think Shannon has much more in her? You know, like now we have a new cast. Like, do you think Shannon's gonna has a long future left with the show? with the way they, they change out casts. Oh, he's like sorority survivor over here. Um, I hope, you know, I mean, I think Shannon offers a hell of a lot more than Heather Dubro. I mean, I do. At least, I mean, Shannon's funny. She's got a lot going on in her life. She's got, you know, you're gonna see like Heather Dubro just pushing her freaking products. That's why she got on the show was to push, push, push. It's one big, huge QVC commercial for her. That's why she got on this show. And it's, it's she, you're gonna see the true colors of, of this woman. And so be my guest. You think people are gonna be shocked as they watch every week? Oh my God. I don't think she even knows what's coming her way. I don't that sounds that sounds good to me. Before, well, I mean, that's be before we wrap up, 
Kelly, we've seen you date lots of people on the show. Rick, you were a single guy about town in New York. Like what, what works here? Like, how, why does this work? I mean, I understand it works, but like, what is it? Why is this like? I'm going to tell you this right now, David, we're the same person, uh, a male and female version in, in many ways of the same person. And I, I've never had a connection like I do with Kelly, where we're finishing each other's sentences. We're having the same thought at the same time. You know, I'll say something. She was like, I was just about to say that. This happens to us almost every day, right? We just like laugh all the time. You know, we just, we're laughing and enjoying each other. And I don't think I've really had chemistry with anybody, you know, sexually, mentally, physically, like. Uh, the chemistry is off the charts. I never um, had, I've never had that before. So we have so much fun together and we both love doing a lot of the same, same things. things. We work out together and, you know, we, we travel a lot together and, and activities that we both love doing. And, you know, we get along with the same kinds of people and uh, she and I just have a connection that's, that's uh, rare and wonderful. Do you think this is Shannon's last season? And she will flip flip this, you know, switch on, on a moment's notice. I want to know what you think. <laughs> I don't know. Listen, I mean, I, when they were making cast changes, like, and you're not there and Bronwyn's not there, I'm not saying Bronwyn should be there. I would have thought they would have made maybe more changes as well. So, I mean, I would have thought maybe more people would have exited at that point. I don't know. Like, I think Shannon was a great housewife. Like, I think it's more like, what does she have going on in life right yeah. now? Uh, that's it but I mean I, I like Shannon I, I don't know like because I don't really know what happens I have high hopes for Noella as well I Jennifer I don't know that much about yeah I think she's kind of a dud but I mean I know her in real life and she's kind of like like blah. I feel like like Shannon had such a great like she was a great housewife like you were married to this awful man and it was a horrible marriage, you know, and then this happened and then like she got divorced and then she got fat and just, and then she lost the weight and QVC. Like, so Shannon's had like such an evolution and now she has. So I feel like if there's still a lot going on with her and I guess, I mean, how is she going to interact with everyone else and how is she going to get along with Heather? I guess we'll find out. You're going to find out. Yeah. But I do think so. I mean, I don't necessarily, I just think that the way that they change these shows up, as you know, it's more like, well, who's like, if you do process of elimination, who's going to be the next person to go, but maybe no one needs to go because it's a new cast and that wow. gives them at least two years. Why does somebody have to go? I mean, I, I, I think keeping the originals are, uh, what, what is people get invested? I, I don't understand how, and, and they wouldn't give me my Q ratings, which makes me think that I did my Q ratings were good because they wouldn't give them to me. 